this is the secret to my sleep ponytail. It's very ironic that I do a nice, tight looking sleep ponytail. Hey guys, I'm Miss Lauren Lee 11 and I am back with another one. Okay guys, today you can see my hair is looking just fabulous and just so this is what I'm working with right now. My curls are looking very delightful, but it is time for wash day. I'm trying to preserve this wash and go because I'm being lazy. I've pushed this wash and go, this is the sixth day now. I usually wash my hair every four days, but today guys, I'm just gonna show you how to stretch it for one more day before I wash my hair. And this is one of my go-to styles. If you saw in my last video, I was wearing a high loose bun. And this video, I'm going to be showing you how to do a loose, sleek ponytail. Two things you will need that I will be using is a hair tie and I will be using a spray bottle of water. So all I'm going to do is, usually when I style my hair with gel guys, I usually have a middle parting. If you don't have a middle parting or if you don't prefer a middle parting, you can part to your desired look. But anyway. What I'm gonna do guys, I'm gonna go ahead and work on one section and then I'm gonna come back and work on the other section. I'm not using any tools. I want to minimize manipulation for as long as possible guys. So I'm just gonna go ahead and spray one section of my hair. I've reactivated the gel enough, so all I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna use any tools, I'm just gonna stretch my hair by doing this, and I'm just gonna put it behind my ear, like so. If you do have any more visible remnants of gel, you can just, like I'm doing, just finger combing them in and smoothing them down, and they should dry um, non-flaky. So I'll sort out the baby hairs in a minute. So I've got that side done. So I'm not gonna put that away for now. I'm just gonna go ahead and do what I've done on this side to the other. It's very important guys that you get these parts of your hair damp enough that they'll lay nice and flat because these are the parts that you're manipulating the most. You can spritz the back if you want to. Um, I'm just gonna spritz my ends, but other than that, I, I'm not really fussed about that bit. And again, I'm just gonna just stretch it out slightly, not too, too much. And the reason why I'm stretching it out, guys, is because I want it to be sleek. Okay, so just kind of finger comb it in. Right, so now I've got something to work with. So you can start on one side like so. I don't mind putting it all back in one, all in one go, but if you do feel like there's some bumps that you'd like to get rid of, then you can go ahead and do that. To me, that's looking sleek enough. I'm happy with that. Okay, and I'm gonna go ahead and do that on the other side. This is a secret to my sleek ponytail. It's very ironic that I do a nice, tight looking sleek ponytail, but I do it very loosely. So, I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna just rip it round twice. So one, then two. There you go. So my hair has remained sleek. So I haven't quite finished yet, guys. So what I'm gonna do again, I'm just gonna go in, keep spritzing. Because I've already got the gel in there from the wash and go, all it's doing is reactivating the gel, so I'm not putting any more product in my hair, guys. Now for these baby hairs, all I'm going to do is reactivate them. So I didn't actually spritz my baby hairs before, and you might wanna do this, guys, without makeup on. But now I'm spritzing them just to reactivate them. And all I'm going to do... So, 
there you have it guys this was literally the quickest hairstyle I do which is a sleek loose ponytail so it looks tight but it, it's not and I find it's best to do these sleek ponytails on dirty hair because your hair is then acting right if you know what I mean your hair is acting the way it should be so that is it guys thank you so much for watching and I will see you Saturday <laughs> alright guys have a great week and I'll see you soon bye